Micronutrients prevent disease and fight aging. Proteins, fats and carbs garner a good amount of attention among dieters and health-conscious consumers alike. While it's true that these macronutrients are absolutely vital to the function of your body, there are many other compounds that play a role in your health as well. In fact, micronutrients work behind the scenes to help foster growth and development. Synthesize DNA, hormones and enzymes. Maintain metabolism, prevent oxidative damage to cells, and more. What are micronutrients? Most of us have heard the term tossed around quite a bit, but few people can actually define micronutrients and explain how they work in the body. The official micronutrients definition includes various types of chemicals that are found in trace amounts in the foods we eat. However, most people recognize micronutrients by common names like vitamins, minerals and antioxidants. Although there are dozens of different micronutrients that are all vital to overall health, here are a few examples of micronutrients that are found in many healthy whole food sources. Fat-soluble vitamins, A, D, E, K water-soluble vitamins, B2, B3, niacin, B6, B12, vitamin C, PP, folate aka VITB9, not synthetic folic acid, pantothenic acid aka VITB5, choline, biotin, VITB7. Minerals, iron, calcium, phosphorus, magnesium, manganese, potassium, copper, selenium, iodine. Micronutrients are essential because they protect our bodies from disease, slow the aging process and help every system in our bodies work properly. The long list of micronutrients functions can range from supporting metabolism to fighting free radicals and promoting overall health. The body uses dozens of different micronutrients every single hour of every single day to keep us energized, produce enzymes and hormones, and prevent nutritional deficiencies. Specific micronutrient deficiencies can result in various problems like mental impairment, poor digestion, thyroid problems and bone loss. Among other roles, the main jobs of micronutrients include synthesizing DNA, facilitating growth, producing digestive enzymes, Helping keep a strong metabolism, breaking down carbs, fats and proteins into usable energy. Aiding in bone mineralization, helping with hormone production. Allowing cells to rejuvenate, slowing oxidation damage or signs of aging caused by free radicals. Allowing muscles to move and helping with tissue repair. Protecting the brain. All of the foods we eat contain nutrients that fall under one of two general categories, micronutrients and macronutrients. Both of these are incredibly important dietary components, and both macronutrients and micronutrients are essential parts of eating a nutritious, healing diet that supports overall health. Why we need different micronutrients. Many micronutrients are considered essential nutrients, which means they are not made within the body. We must get these micronutrients from foods, otherwise we risk micronutrient deficiencies, such as iron deficiency, low potassium, low vitamin B12 or magnesium deficiency. Researchers have classified 13 different types of vitamins, all of which have their own important roles in body. Including protecting against oxidative stress, slowing the aging process and preventing cancer. Besides vitamins, minerals are another type of micronutrient that we need to obtain from the diet. Minerals play a big role in bone development, brain health, cellular function and metabolism, and humans need at least 18 different minerals to function properly. These include macro minerals that we usually think of as electrolytes, such as calcium, magnesium, potassium and sodium, plus other trace minerals that we need in smaller quantities like copper, iodine, iron, manganese, selenium and zinc. Micronutrients of all kinds are important cofactors in DNA synthesis and metabolism, as they are frequently involved in modulating enzymes that help us absorb other nutrients and turn them into fuel for the body. Zinc, for example, is a cofactor for over 100 enzymes. Selenium, on the other hand, is an important mineral for metabolism that is involved in the production of the enzyme glutathione peroxidase, also known as the master antioxidant. No single type of food contains all the micronutrients we need, which is why variety is key. The focus should be on anti-inflammatory foods, meaning those that are fresh and found in nature, including all types of colorful vegetables, fruits, beans nuts, whole grains, and quality animal foods like seafood and eggs. 
Eating a wide array of different whole foods can fill in any gaps in your diet and make sure you're getting the entire list of micronutrients in your diet. It's best to get your vitamins and minerals through whole food sources, as these foods supply a wealth of micronutrients and macronutrients to help optimize your health. In fact, studies have shown that the complex mixture of micronutrients found naturally in a diet high in fruit and vegetables is likely more effective than large doses of a small number of micronutrients. Here are a few nutritious foods that are rich in a wide variety of important micronutrients, giving you the most bang for your buck in terms of nutrition. Green Leafy Vegetables All kinds of greens are excellent sources of vitamin C, vitamin A, vitamin K, folate and magnesium. Considering how low in calories leafy greens like kale, collard greens, spinach, bok choy, cabbage and romaine lettuce are, they're some of the most nutrient-dense foods that you can add to your diet. Colorful Veggies Red peppers, broccoli, squash, cauliflower, green peppers, artichokes, carrots, asparagus, tomatoes and mushrooms are all great for providing fiber, magnesium, potassium, vitamin A and vitamin C. Almost all vegetables provide micronutrients in moderate to high levels, so during meals try filling half your plate with a mix of veggies as often as you can. Fruits, especially berries. Strawberries, blueberries, raspberries, melon, pineapple, apples, pears and kiwis are all high in antioxidants and nutrients like flavonoids, vitamin A and C, fiber, and potassium. Berries, in particular, are especially high in antioxidants and are linked with benefits like better brain health and cancer prevention. Many berries, like blueberries, are also high in quercetin, a type of protective flavonoid phytonutrient that fights inflammation and blocks free radical formation. Nuts and seeds, nuts. And seeds like chia, flax, hemp, almonds and walnuts are high in heart-healthy omega-3 fatty acids as well as fiber. They're also a great source of antioxidants and micronutrients like vitamin E, selenium, magnesium, boron and choline. Grass-fed, pasture-raised, wild animal products. Liver, wild seafood, cage-free eggs, grass-fed beef and pasture-raised poultry are excellent sources of micronutrients like iron, B vitamins, vitamin A and zinc. Each type of animal protein offers different benefits, for example, chicken or beef liver is packed with micronutrients and is now being called a superfood, because it's dense in B vitamins, iron and vitamin A and cage-free eggs offer multiple nutrients, including choline, vitamin A and vitamin E. Beans and legumes, as some of the best sources of fiber, beans and legumes are great for promoting digestion and controlling cholesterol. They're also high in calcium, manganese, folate, phosphorus and iron. Whole grains, ancient grains like quinoa, rice, amaranth, oats and buckwheat provide B vitamins and minerals like manganese and phosphorus. While ancient grains can be a part of a balanced diet, it's best to get the majority of your micronutrients and dietary fiber from more nutrient-dense foods like non-starchy veggies, starchy veggies and fruit. Micronutrients are essential to many aspects of health and play a central role in nearly every bodily function. One of the best ways to squeeze more micronutrients into your day is by switching up your diet. Adding more fruits, vegetables, whole grains, nuts, seeds and legumes can help you meet your micronutrient needs and prevent nutritional deficiencies. Incorporating a few healthy and nutritious recipes into your routine is an easy and delicious way to get started. Micronutrients in traditional medicine. The importance of micronutrients is recognized in many forms of traditional medicine, which is why healthy, whole foods rich in micronutrients are often used medicinally to treat a wide variety of health conditions and ailments. The Ayurvedic diet, for example, focuses on including plenty of healing herbs and spices, fermented foods, seasonal vegetables, healthy meats, nuts and seeds to help nourish the body, enhance well-being and meet your micronutrient needs. Meanwhile, traditional Chinese medicine incorporates many ingredients rich in micronutrients to restore the balance in the body, optimize nutritional intake, and achieve and maintain better health. Although most people can meet their micronutrient needs by following a healthy, well-balanced diet, some may require supplementation to meet their nutritional needs. Additionally, if you have any underlying health conditions or are following a restrictive diet, it's important to monitor your micronutrient intake carefully and consider supplementation if needed. A multivitamin supplement can be a good option for many and can help round out your diet to fill in any nutritional gaps.
Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel Best for Health.